we're back with Uthgar the Brave. As you can see, he's a Nordic battle mage. He's got a lot of heavy armor, magic robes over the top of that, some ebony pauldrons there, ebony gauntlets, ebony boots, and I believe just a normal steel plate chest piece, if I'm not mistaken. We're in Breeze Home right now. We were just putting stuff away last time. Uh, as you see, there's Sanguine's Rose. I gotta get rid of the Staff of Holidor, too. Make sure that I put away Holidor's Staff so we're not selling it. As you see. Because we got some stuff to sell. Oh, well, yeah. We got a bunch of stuff to sell. So, I don't know what we're gonna do yet. I'm just getting on. Got to level up. That's good. Honored to see you again, my thing. There's Lydia. We did a lot yesterday, so I'm trying to figure out and remember where we were here. Oh. Playing with the shield while it loads. To be on Skyrim loading screen there. Shield held like that would break your arm, by the way. Be in big trouble. Oh yeah, I was supposed to sleep in there. Oh well. We definitely need to sell stuff. Make sure we got our tanning done. Yep. Make sure we got all our ore smelted. That keeps our carry good weight a little lower, Looking which is good. Protect yourself or deal some damage. We're looking to. Probably should have put away the Blade of Falkreath, but I didn't. Uh, hunting bow. All this iron stuff can go. I got that already. As you see, we need to get about 3,500 gold pieces. We're at 2,000, so we're getting somewhat there. Good luck out there. Thank you. Our weight's down to 535. Going around selling some stuff, and then we're gonna Welcome go to questing. Welcome, General Goods. Welcome indeed. Everything, trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. stuff I gotta put away. That's okay. Do come back. So all that building stuff that we've put in Breeze Home, we gotta go get and then Wait, put it in 
No, you don't. And then we gotta go put it in Lakeview Manor. And then we're gonna go questing. That way we have more stuff. We wanna get all our construction stuff towards Lakeview Manor, though. It's that time. too much stiff. We'll go ahead and put that away. That helps eight pounds. There we go. Okay. We are moseying along. We're gonna go to we're gonna fast travel to Breeze home. We're not gonna walk there. That's a little ridiculous. to go after like Azura Star and all that stuff. That'll be fun. Not quite there. We want to get the Lord's Mail at level 40. We're, we're level 34. I just haven't leveled up yet. Excuse me. Figure I'll play this for two or three hours, then go do some things, and then come back later and play for another couple hours. Honored to see you again, my fame. Maybe. Uh, let's go see what she's done to the inside of our house. Nothing. this stuff put up. Okay. Things are loading in, which is good. Do you want to get a bed for her? It seems, it seems reasonable. Put a couple beds in there. As you see, we're just filling in all the things. Now the upstairs is completed, which is good. This is good. We're doing very well for ourselves. Go in the basement here. I mean, we got all these things to put on, so we might as well do it. Interesting, I've never had this before, so. be able to see stuff. Stuff's going to be auto-populating in here now. very dark in here still. We need to go to our, we need the stuff. So we're gonna go ahead and get out of here and it'll, it'll auto populate as we, as it goes, which is fine. It's taking care of business. I 
just see things are coming along. Looking much, much more homey, much more capable. Pick up that potion of healing. The alchemy lab is almost ready to go, so we'll go ahead and start stuffing ingredients in there. Got plenty of those. Very good. See, now she has a choice of beds and stuff, and that's nice. Going to books. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and that's it. Alright, so nine books on that shelf. Pretty good situation there. Built up a lot of a lot of stuff there, so that's good. What do you need, my fan? Uh, probably an armory. Oh, we need we need the wood. Long life to you. Of course. What are we? I'll see. Is there anything else you need? 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 I'll see to it. Is there anything? You need. Still have two thousand two hundred and forty-six gold, so that's good. We need to go. We need to go make some quarried stone, which is right here. So we're going to mine some quarried stone and get it going because it's useful. Let's see, we get four per hit, or four per three hits. I guess this is going to be like iron iron mining. So if you have a Coke or something, drink it if you got it. Kind of the annoying part of Skyrim, just sitting here waiting for stuff to grind out. I could have done this before stream, but I didn't think about that, so I'm doing it during. No more blizzard today. Yesterday it was snowed quite well. To those that don't live in snowy areas and wish for snow, yesterday is the reason you don't wish for snow. not good. We need a little more clay. <coughs> Long life to you, Thane. Honor to you, my Thane. Of course. What are we running? Certainly. I'll have it delivered. I'm not going to sit there and wait for her. I'd rather spend the 200 gold and be annoyed at her. I just spent 200 gold on clay. Why is it not? Good to see you. Oh, there's another clay deposit up there. Oops. We're gonna, we're gonna mine 20 of it. You don't need a lot of clay. We're at 8. It's 12. 
16. And 20. Okay, let's go inside and see if we can't build on to our armory. Honor to you. <laughs> We're gonna put a fire put in here. There we go. Do do do. Open this door now. As you see, it's an armory. Miscellaneous. We'll put a grindstone there. Tanning rack. We'll miss some goat horns, so. Okay, we're able to get all that. That's awesome. Alright, so pretty much everything I want is put in here, which is good. It'll auto-generate, as you see, it's all getting put in. The weapon racks are getting put in, that's good. They're over there, that's good, so that gives us 15 weapon rack things. Good stuff, good stuff. Do I dare build bedrooms? Yeah, I might as well get it started. Skyrim the construction game. <laughs> Super exciting stuff. Yeah, we're we're not building nothing else. So what we'll do is we'll put this in the chest. Oh, that's where the clay was. Whatever. Put that in there. Put those in there. Anything to do with building or modding our weapons and armor we're going to put in here. So that goes in there. Gold can go in there. Watch our weight just diminish, which is good. Uh, I didn't need to put the quartz in there, that's okay. Silver ingot can go in there, stall room can go in there. Straw. Yeah, that opened up all kinds of questing carry weight, and we're gonna go ahead and level up and add five more pounds to that, actually. There we go. Alteration, chanting, smithing, yeah, it's time to put it in heavy armor because our next thing is going to make it where heavy armor wears half as much. So it's important to put on battle wary now. Okay, we are ready to do some stuff. Let's quick save it and go see what we want to do. We don't need to be ready as bacon yet. Join the companions. Should either join the companions or head towards Iverstead? I say we join the companions. Let's join a guild. So today is the companions. When we shall join them, and they shall be our companions. Their quest line's kind of fun for me. I enjoy it, except for the werewolf stuff. The werewolf stuff could have been a different entire faction entirely. 
a lot of entires in there. But it's true. The, the werewolf stuff is kind of stupid. Finding Wurthgard and putting it all together and doing that stuff and random jobs for the guild, that, that was enough. It was fun. Kind of a dick. He's a dick. You couldn't possibly be the Dragonborn of Legend, could you? Nope. You see, this is actually a ship turned upside down. It's the original ship that the Atmorans came in. They turned it upside down and made it a roof, which is something like Vikings would do, so I mean, it makes sense. Are those two at it again? Come on now, watch the footwork. Yeah. Come on, damn you! You think you Nothing bad happens to you ever. Don't mind them. Just working out some issue. So you think you have what it takes? Lucky for you, I'm not the one who makes that decision. Talk to Codlack. Who knows? Maybe he's in a generous mood. Okay. Well, I'm gonna go talk to Codlack. I would. Uthgar has no love for Dunmer. Just below the high elves. Ooh. I don't know why I'm yawning so much. But I still hear the call of the blood. We do. It is our burden to bear. But we can overcome. You have my brother and I, obviously. But I don't know if the rest will go along quite so easily. Leave that to me. A stranger comes to our hall. Would you now? Here. Yes, I do. Let me have a look at you. Hmm. Yes, perhaps. A certain strength of spirit. Master, you're not truly considering accepting him. I am nobody's master, Vilkis. And last I checked, we had some empty beds in your vasker for those with a fire burning in their hearts. Apologies. But perhaps this isn't the time. I've never even heard of this outsider. Sometimes I'm the Thane of Whiterun. Sometimes men and women come to and Falkreath. It makes Landowner. Homeowner. What matters is their heart. And their arm. Of course. How are you in battle, boy? That may be so. I can handle myself. This is Vilkus. He will test your arm. Vilkus, take him out to the yard and see what he can do. I. I. Come on. So we're gonna start the companion's quest. We're not going to focus hardly at all at being a, a werewolf. It's not going to matter to us. It's simply a means to gain power. <laughs> power! The Skyforge steel weapons are disappointing. It should have been a special bonus or something. But they're not. They're just labeled Skyforge Steel. It's, it's nothing special. It's literally not even a different, like, design or anything in the vanilla game, so... It's just disappointment. Skyforge should have been something. Like the place where you... If you mod in certain mods, it's the place where you can craft ebony, stallroom, and dragon armor. See, I 
stupidly shout. The old man said to have a look at you. Yeah, well, I'll have a look at you. So, let's do this. Just have a few swings at me so I can see your form. Don't worry. Okay. I can take it. You can't I don't care it. if you can or not. There you go. I mean, literally. Not bad. Three swings. This time won't be so easy. You might just make it. But for now, you're still a whelp to us, new blood. So you do what we tell you. Here's my sword. Go take it up to Yorlin to have it sharpened. And be careful. It's probably worth more than you are. So I'm gonna go take this sword up. Pick that flower. Pick these flowers. Because we are Uthgar the flower picker. Which is better than Uthgar the nose picker. What brings you here? Vilkas. I'm guessing you're the newcomer then. I'm just doing what he asked. If you are some stuffy merchant or a Jarl's footstool. Around here, you'll want to learn to live your own life. Remember, nobody oh, don't worry, I do. in the companions. Not are you a companion? A companion myself, but none of them know how to work a forge properly, and I'm honored to serve them. My name is Eorlin Greymane. I work the Skyforge. Best steel in all of Skyrim. All of Tamriel. Not true. But it should be. Well, Someone has to be in charge. Sure managed it, but they have. No leader since Yzgrimor. Kodlak is the harbinger. And he's a sort of advisor for the whole group. But every man is his own. Every woman her own. I'll be going. What is it? I'm working on a shield for Aela. My wife is in mourning, and I need to get back to her soon. I'd be much obliged if you could take this to Aela for me. Yeah, we can do that. That's a good man. See, it's just a steel shield. It's nothing special. Bad because Ale is pretty special. Isgrimor himself wouldn't have the patience to deal with all the rabble around here. Yay, I have your shield. Ah, good. I've been waiting for this. Even though you're an archer. I remember you. So the old man thinks you've got some heart, I guess. You know this one? I saw him training in the yard with Vilkis. Ah, yes. I heard you gave him quite a thrashing. Don't let Vilkis catch you saying that. Do you think you could handle Vilkis in a real fight? I don't care for boasting. Ah, a man of action. Here, let's have Farkas show That's you right. you'll be resting your head. Farkas. Did you call me? Of course we did, Ice Brain. Show this new blood where the rest of the whelp sleeps. New blood? Oh, I remember you. Come on, follow me. Skior and Ayala like to tease me, but they're good people. They challenge us to be our best. No, they're not. Nice to have a new face around. It gets boring here sometimes. I hope we keep you. This can be a rough life. The quarters are up here. Just pick a bed and fall in it when you're tired. 
Telma will keep the place clean. She always has. All right, so here you are. Looks like the others are eager to meet you. Come to me or Ayala if you're looking for work. Once you've made a bit of a name for yourself, Skior and Vilkas might have things for you to do. Good luck. Welcome to the Companions. So we're joining the Companions By today. By the way, if you're looking for something to do, we've got trouble right here in Whiterun Hold. Nothing we can't handle. The Falmer. Out of there trouble. There have been reports that they've been attacking people at night. Excellent. Yeah, Short we can do that. No mercy. Why are the Falmer and Skyrim? We don't like the Falmer, remember? The, the creepy little things. And they're here in Whiterun. We need to take care of this. It's a disaster. In Whiterun, too, of all the places. I wasn't going to do a companion quest, but I mean... Uh, we're going to go to Shimmer Mist Cave. Yeah, there's, there's Falmer and Shimmer Mist Cave, that's for sure. We'll go ahead and clear that cave out. We got no, we got no reason not not to go in here and mess stuff up. Where is the cave? <laughs> Here it is. Here it is. Very good. It's unpleasantly dark in here. We haven't run into the Falmer yet, so... It's a new experience for us. There's one. There's several farmer in here. This is a terrible place. You see, not even the music wants to play. Collect the farmer gear. As the farmer, they don't like outsiders. And I don't like farmer. depressing place. It doesn't get any better. We're getting closer and closer to Blackreach. Such a sad place. Just 
see, we're getting pretty well slapped around here. It's good. Armor is strong. They can do some damage. This is why we got that ebony armor going. Fast heal. those egg sacks. It's in the chest. Ooh, an ebony helmet. Yeah. <laughs> this was a good chest. Special arrows, an ebony helmet. Yeah. See, it knew I was complaining about chests all that time, and look what happened. My, oh my. Such a dark and gloomy place. Might be time to start thinking about one-handed weaponry. Could just start going cave delving. You want candlelight. Especially if Charis starts showing up, which they're going to. I mean, that is the way of things. We're in the room that we need to be in, though. Mother of Pearl. See, Charis. Bad. That was only one. There's several in here. Tunnel, shit. Excuse my language. It's f not really the best thing ever there. See, you know they're here. Hey, you've seen them. But they, like, ran in a different direction, so... They're in there. Which is fine. They can stay in there for a second while I... Collect their eggs. Very finicky crap. I'm not gonna sit here all day and try and make the container show the loot. It's like you saw it, right? I've been poissoned. He's been eliminated. Still two more. This one's a Reaper, so it's a little strong. See, that poison's sucking my life away. Luckily, fast healing is free for me. Go ahead and just throw a quick save. That was a very dangerous fight for me. Lost candlelight. Flying ones are what scares me. Like when we get to the flying Charis, then I'll be scared out of my mind. Creepy bug things. Right 
right now I'm literally just robbing these people of their, you know, eggs for future generations. So I understand why they'd attack me. I'd, I'd be mad too. But, you know. Protagonist stuff. I gotta do what I gotta do. Super intense music, and I'm picking mushrooms. See, there's the worthless chest that I'm used to. Ah. things where we need the perk, the perk points. <laughs> uh, we're able to get destruction and restoration to 40 here. So I need the perk points for it. We're about to go in a dwarven ruin. This is where the Falmer really are. I just see I'm just absolutely pummeling him with free magic. Oh crap. Dwarven Centurion. <laughs> he just showed up out of nowhere. And I absolutely annihilated him. Which is insane. That's top end gear, or top end Dwarven enemy there. We're going to take all kinds of fun from him. Yep. All kinds of fun. Palmer sword. We're taking all those. We're taking everything on this table, it looks like. Everything dwarven we want. If it's dwarven, we want it. Oh wow. It's a good dagger. See now we have Dwemer corns. They're known as Dumax. Very good. That takes care of our quest. It's a good thing we have super high spells because this thing would have been very dangerous. Gonna go ahead and quick save because we can explore in here now. Back to the game's telling us, kind of, too. As we exit. Okay, well, that was fun. To Shimmer Mist Cave we go. It's telling us to go back that way. Farkas. 
Honestly, totally worth it. I might overdo it on... I say I'm never going to do it on... Overdo it on Illusion, and then end up doing, like, Legendary 9. I can't help it. It's there, it's available for me. I feel like you should do it. Turn to daytime. I want to unlock that watchtower. Not for any particular reason, I just want the thing unlocked on my map. It gives me an excuse to... Home run. I don't even know where it went. It's gone. Gone forever. Pick up some corn more. That's good. You see my big Nordic battle axe here. And get replaced. Not yet, though. It had that in there, okay. We'll eat the venison, take the flowers. Take the flowers. take everything except the first shoes because I just am anti first shoe. Drink the ale. There you go. As you see. Oops. <laughs> it's a good thing I was not facing a guard there. That would have been really bad. We are Making our way back to White Run. I wanted to make sure I leveled up, I wasn't sure. Okay, well, we did, so. Quick save it. Map it. Things to sell. Wait, I know you. I've been looking for you. A letter. Not sure who. F Looks like that's it. Got to go. Our first letter from Todd oh. Howard. Looking He's to the friend. Or deal some damage. There's this word of power you should really go check out.
Good luck out there. So you see, they finally started giving out ebony stuff. Break down that. Break down that. Break down that. Break down those. Very good. Oh, we need leather strips. That's something we're going to have shortly, so that's fine. See? Leather strips. Plenty of leather strips. That's why that, that deer was important to kill. Because we're about to replace our Nordic War Axe. Sad as it may seem. But I mean, look at that. How can you not want to have any battle axe? I'd rather have an ebony sword. I'm just an axe user, so I'm gonna. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna get the ebony war axe and upgrade it. It goes from 5 and now it's 14. Can't believe how cheap it is. Get a critical hit and it's pretty good. It's good as a steel dagger. Okay, well, that's where it is. I thought it was better than that. I was wrong. Where are you at? Nope. Sorry. Nothing. I don't know. She disappeared. How sad. Let me know if you see anything you like. So we're on the huntsman. Ah. Bows and arrows for the mighty huntsman. Because he usually has lockpicks. But we lowered our carry weight a little bit there with getting rid of the bows and the short spear. So that's fine. We'll go ahead and level up here. There we go. This will decrease our carry weight by a little bit. As you see, it's not down to 287. We're much better. Two-handed. Yeah, there's some boss stuff there. <laughs> to put it lightly. So you see, you do have access 
the Sun Blast, and then Holy Hands, and then Stellar Core. So, that's a, we got a level up to get. You know nothing of his work. Apparently, his wife. She knows everything about him. Disease. We don't need that in our lives. That's one nice thing about Muffle. You can level it up constantly just by walking around and using it because now it's free. So Illusion's just going to be absurd. Just absurd. Skior says that I have... And I've already received word that the client is satisfied. You have done well for yourself and for the companions. Cool. Skior was looking for you earlier. Don't know. What's he he just said he needed to talk. I don't like making him angry, but there is some work for you if you want it. Some people don't think I'm smart. I'll show you what I can about protecting yourself. No, you won't. I've heard you may actually be stronger there you are. than you look. Perhaps we can hunt together sometime. I did. Your time, it seems, has come. Cool. Last what week, a scholar came to us. He said he knew where we could find another fragment of Wuthrad. He seemed a fool Neat. to me. But if he's right, the honor of the companions demands that we seek it out. There's a fine line I'm between gonna go find it. and bootlegging. We've decided this will be your trial. Do well, and you'll be counted among the companions. Farkas will be your shield sibling on this venture, Well, He'll answer any questions you have. Try not to disappoint, or to get him killed. Hmm? This is where a lot of people are disappointed in this guild because it just takes you straight into Farkas and he turns into a werewolf and clearly and then you become a werewolf and you just you don't do anything to earn it so it becomes frustrating and this is the only way I think you can turn into a werewolf in the base game excuse me because once you get him you can't use another companion until you finish this quest and this quest can be difficult if you're over leveled like I am because all the dragger are gonna be higher end dragger which is why I'm trying to get the restoration spell get him before he leaves, get him before he leaves. I hope you've read it yourself. So I'm told. You'll be my shield, Let's brother. See if you impress. Isgramor was the Truth hero who started the companions. Wuthrad was his weapon. He came from the ancient homeland and killed all the elves. But not all of them, because some of them are still here. I want you to make Why sure you're trial. If you are honorable and strong, then I can call you brother. Don't delay. I'll meet you there. Brother. I'm 
know where it is. I mean, I gotta know, but... So let's go ahead and do this quest. We're going to walk towards that ruin. It's not that far away, and it just gives us a chance to level up our illusion. Like I said, I want to get to level 36 for the restoration stuff. There's just so much I need to do in terms of I need to level up. And the thing is, once I get to level 40, then we can go get Lord's Mail. So much to do, so much to do, so much to do. That is this game, though. It's a good thing. Lots of stuff to do, and it's all... Pretty much right now, it's all pretty much fun, so... If you don't enjoy the dungeons, then you probably don't enjoy Skyrim. Because... Skyrim is about the world. And the dungeons are... A large part of how that world is expressed through various enemies and puzzles that are children's toys and it's just the way it is though spell here. Now I feel better. We are kind of strong enough to take on the giant, but we aren't gonna. We're not fighting giants right now. We're, we have a purpose. We're just constantly going to be casting illusion here. I know it's dumb, but it is how we level it up. And we need to level it up. several levels away from being very, very happy. Because not only that, Dawnbreaker's going to be our sword. Which means we're going to take some levels of enchantment. So you can see where this is going to take, probably, to get everything I really, really want, probably level 45, maybe closer even to 50, which is why 50 is considered, like, the big bad of the game, like, your, your crowning shape there. See it? Just wipe the floor with them. Messing around right now. Well, there is, but obviously we're killing mud crabs. But we're doing it to level up our destruction. On the way to. where we need to be.
Okay. Very good. You should see deer. We're gonna go down. Something. Take you down. No longer an issue. Most enemies are no longer gonna be an issue. Some will be, but for the most part, we are the most powerful being on this Skyrim. Except for some gray beards and some Solstheim enemies, and obviously dragons. Hey Farkas, we're gonna go in. I'm gonna go in and take on the baddies. to collect all this hanging moss and stuff. Alright, in we go. Dustman's Cairn. Major story progression here. I'm gonna check a message while this is loading just right quick. Sunblast is. Looks like someone's been digging here. And recently. Yeah, why is that? Tread light. First try. Good, that's what we use. Oh, a glass shield, that's pretty. We're giving that to either Lydia or Rhea. Upgrades, people, upgrades. Let's see. This is where we get Sunblast. This is a nice thing. Farkas is able to resist the Sunblast while I'm able to use it. Why are you here? Must be a scourge. You see, it's my sunblast versus his. Sunblast is making a difference. Yeah, I'm definitely enjoying the sunblast. While the dragger are not. You're essential, you're fine. You look terrible though, 
far, because you look like you got beat up pretty bad there. Interesting, I'll take that. Restless Tracker. Ebony Sword. That's why I was hesitant to make an Ebony Sword, because... Dragger Death Lords have a lot of them. Man, we need to heal you. You just look terrible. <laughs> what? Hey, that felt good. We should keep moving. I mean. You insist, dude. You got pretty well wrecked. Sunblast is going to be one of my primary dungeon clearing spells because of how things are in this game. With the dragger. Oops, I'm back down to where I don't want to be. Plus, you saw it really boosted my restoration skill and Despite what Skyrim says, restoration is really important. It's your healing spells. Like, I don't know why you make fun of restoration. That makes no sense. Make fun of alteration or illusion. Or make fun of mysticism, because they don't even have it in the game anymore. Which is stupid. I miss mysticism. I know it doesn't really have a point anymore, because they got rid of the strength, intelligence, willpower endurance, luck, speed stuff, but it just, it was a school of magic and they got rid of it. They literally just got rid of a school of magic. And they're like, oh, well, they combined it with alteration. Yeah, but alteration sucks, too, in the base game. It's not useful until you get paralysis, and that's just stupid. Not breaking down the blade of Falkreath. That's not gonna happen yet. I'll learn the enchantment once I can, you know, survive it, but jeez. Or keep the thing here. Ooh, a glass long mace. That's pretty. Ebony boots, that'll go towards either Lydia or Rhea. That upgrade for them, upgrades people, upgrades, we like that. strip. Nothing wrong with leather strip. Never anything wrong with healing potions. You'll never see me complain about a healing potion being in a chest or anything like that. I think the quest is broken because Farkas is technically dead. We might have to reload, which is stupid. Lose all that progress because stupid people do stupid things. That's why I'm not a big fan of the Companions quest line. There's so many chances for it to just absolutely bizarre out on you. We'll sit here and wait. See what happens. But I ain't waiting forever. Con no. We're gonna have to reload. Luckily I was able to load that, but man, that's gonna suck. He's gonna take forever to get to wherever he's going. Good. 
I don't even know if we can complete the quest with him like this. We might as well do healing hands while we're... As he slowly makes his way towards us. Escort missions. You gotta love them, even when they're not really escort missions. What? Hey, that felt good. Coming, he's coming. Come on. Jeez the weeds, I hate these missions. We have other people with you. This is why I travel alone. This is why Superman works alone. Yeah, I went there, Batman. And Robin. <laughs> and Orcish Gauntlets this time. I'm gonna throw a quick save. The quick save isn't gonna matter because it's just not. He's slowly making his way towards us. Sacrifice place. Be careful around here. Let's look for a way to open the bars. He was glitched there for a minute. He wasn't moving was bad, so I had to come back for him a little bit. He saw he tried to stand up. should keep moving. A small Skior thinks you should find it, and I'm supposed to watch you.
stuck. He ain't going anywhere. We have to redo it. This is ridiculous. Sometimes this game's ridiculous. But he just ain't moving, so. Tragic, really. I hate missions where you have to find, like, you have to deal with this nonsense. Be careful around the bear. Like, I didn't ask Score to come with me. I don't need him. No, I don't even need you. Good, you're still standing this time. This time I'm not gonna take your stuff. Still gonna take his stuff though. The ebony sword's still mine. We are in better situation than we were last time, so that's that is good. We're we're doing better. He's actually moving around this time. That was very annoying. All right, Farkas. I mean, I did find some different stuff, so I can't complain too much. I mean, I will, but. Old Nord sacrifice place. Be careful around here. Let's look for a way to open. Still got the glass mace and ebony boots. Okay, good. That makes me happy. Sometimes the random generator just isn't kind to you, and that would have sucked. Go ahead and break down that glass dagger. Gotta see what this message is here. And activate this and see what happens. Okay, good. 
Now look what you've gotten yourself into. No worries. Just sit tight. I'll find the release. What was that? It's time to die, dog. We knew you'd be coming here. Your mistake, companion. Which one is that? It doesn't matter. He wears that armor, he dies. Killing you will make for an excellent story. None of you will be alive to tell it. Hey, never just come here. So as you can I see, scare you. everyone's gone. It's a blessing given to some of us. We can be like wild beasts, fearsome. Oh no, only the circle have the beast blood. Prove your honor to be a companion. Eyes on the prey, not the horizon. We should keep moving. Still the Draugr to worry about. Soon we won't need those cure disease potions. I go ahead and save. Is someone there? Over here. Oh no. Gonna try now, huh? <laughs> Just give ah! up!
there's Nordic bow. I like Nordic bows, they're pretty. I like the no design of the Nordic weapons in this game. Sand. Nothing serious though. Stall room mine. I like the idea of having a stall room in Skyrim. Mind moving on. The magic potions are nice, except I don't need them. <laughs> Nordic Cortex staff. It makes sense for these guys to have Nordic here. This lord can't prove otherwise. <laughs> Shut up! I'll rip you in half. Damn you! I mean, there's literally no reason for me not to just. You know what? Interesting, interesting, interesting. Take that. Very good. Silver mace, huh? Hawk feathers are ingredients used hey. to make your disease potions. Which is why they have so many of them. I would have missed out on six Draugr coins there. That would have been bad. I don't want to be missing out on things. don't know what I just opened. <laughs> but I did. I opened something. Oh, master level chest. What are the odds, people? What are the odds? Pretty good. We're going to get this 
figured out. So they're going to be this way. Which it wasn't. Or this way. Hmm. That's awkward. Hmm. This is depressing. <laughs> so we know it's over there, and we know it's just basically... Basically a tap. Hmm. This is odd because I don't get it. You can't even be that much off. That's why I hate... Nope. I hate the lockpicking game. I'm not even wasting my time with that. That is stupid. That's stupid game design. I get it's a difficult lock, but my goodness. I can't even... The Xbox doesn't even allow for movement that refined. sword and your potions. Alright. Game, sometimes you peeve me off to no end and sometimes you just know what buttons to push for me. That wasn't what I wanted. <laughs> this is. Look, you take care of those guys. I'm taking care of Jarger. Can you, can you, seriously, can you handle some things? You won't get away from prepared to die. Are we going to die to death? Curious to silver hand resist? Okay. Oh yeah, I said I was gonna use my Do ebony sword. I mean my worst is destruction magic, so lucky you. I say we walloped him pretty good. Full health. Congratulations, you didn't slow us down at all. Like you can tell it's a modded spell. It's not the best graphically, but it works. And it's getting my restoration skill up, so I approve. It's nice to be able to use offensive restoration magic. I think that's why Skyrim picks on it so much. There's no offensive skills and restoration. It's all healing. If you want to play a paladin, this is the way to do it. taking care of business here. Let's see. I'll take you. So you don't mind a depth chest? You can open a depth chest. That master chest was stupid. Steel 
plate helmet. That was a good chest. Shows up, we can kill it. I'm not watching there, brother. Go ahead and level that up now, as you can see. This on one handed. We'll make one hand a little bit stronger now. I'll have your head. Thank you. I feel like you did most of the work this time. It's unusual. But I had trouble seeing things, so it doesn't count. But we will quick save because we were. I know what that is. As you see, we're going into Dustman's Crypt. Pretty much sneak attacked him. Take every advantage they can in this. Rest restoration magic is difficult to level up, so if you get the chance, do it. from me, but you're not. Oh, 
<laughs> that time Farkas let me handle it. It's like, you know what, you're doing fine. Fast healing. Like I said, there's very few things now that scare me. So there's a chest here somewhere. Ooh, almost first try. Not quite, but it gave me an idea where it was, so that's good. Nine septums, absolutely worthless. Bunch of useful alchemy ingredients. We'll take that, no problem. And of course, the stamina potion is nice. A quick save here because all of these guys are about to just be so much fun. See, it makes sense for them only to have septums, especially two for the eyes. A weapon or two might make sense, but, you know, it's not necessary. Man, that was not good. Pushing the healing was, though. That's always good. What I'm saying, come on. He dropped from the sky. That was crazy. Hmm. I've done this many times and I always get lost here. First of all, quick save because we've done what we needed to. Uh,
so we don't hurt Fergus. Another reason the Sunblast skill is so good, because it has no effect on him. Besides just raising our stuff. Did you see that? Dragger's Gurgis getting walloped. Near the end of our capability of carrying charges. Insanity. That wasn't the right way. Farkas, you led me astray. <laughs> no, he didn't. I'm just a goober. That's why I made a sword. Let's see, we're taking it on the chin. I'm gonna crush you like a bug. He's dead now. So we'll fast heal. Cause it's fast. Sunblast. Go ahead and sit, make a quick save because we beat that Death Lord, which is, you know, a thing. We don't need the Iron War Axe. Man, I like the Ebony Greatsword. We'll take it because I feel like. drop something. See, I did have that. Okay. I knew I wasn't totally off the wall. I need to lose 13 pounds, which is... there's some. Yeah, we'll go ahead and lose some of the fur and just keep it there. That way we can pick up something if it's really worth my time. And this is where everything goes to nuts out on me. Go ahead. A potion of vigorous healing. All right, cool. Now the fun begins. We're gonna save here and let the fun come to me. Everything's gonna pop up. I'll tear you to pieces. Just see, the restoration skill's gonna love this room. See it slowly. <laughs> Taking down these draggers. We're doing pretty good so far. So far, so good. Now we're starting to get into some trouble. We're, 
We're getting out outnumbered. I mean, I'm doing fine, it's just... Very good, very good. Soul gem. Those will be useful later. Jasper. Basically looking to see if we can get any tracker coins, and we're getting lots of them. Opal's nice. Topaz. A lot of Draugr coins. Bone meal, we'll take the bone meal, no problem there. There we go, good. Overall, that was very much good. That was very good. Yeah. <clears throat> Made a lot of, a lot of treasure happen there. And we cleared the dungeon, and we made it possible for certain things to happen, which is a good thing. We're just going to mosey on out of here. White run. six hours, even though we really should wait five, but we wait six. The tanning wreck. Very good. Smelter, let's see if we have any... Go ahead and make 
make some building material. Not a lot, just you know, a couple of nails. Gives me 86 in smithing. Take a look. Good. Good luck cool. out there. I know, which just destruction magic is so useful in this game. Once you mod it, useless without it. But wait, yeah. I know you. No, you don't know anything. We've been awaiting your return. Watch that come. Follow me. <laughs> Why should I care? <laughs> that was totally what I would say, too. <laughs> I don't care. Brothers and sisters of the Circle, today we welcome a new soul into our mortal fold. This man has endured, has challenged, and has shown his valor. Who will speak for him? I stand witness to the courage of the soul before us. Would you raise your shield in his defense? I would stand at his back, that the world might never overtake us. And would you raise your sword in his honor? It stands ready to meet the blood of his foes. And would you raise a mug in his name? I would lead the song of triumph as our meat hall reveled in his stories. Then the judgment of this circle is complete. His heart beats with fury and courage that have united the companions since the days of the distant green summers. Let it beat with ours that the mountains may echo and our enemies may tremble at the call. It, it shall, shall be so. so. Well, boy, you're one of us now. I trust you won't disappoint. I see you've been allowed sure to know werewolves. some secrets. Not every companion. Some take to it more. Well, I grow old. I worry that Shore won't help living his beast. Some may prefer an eternity in his hunt. Yes, but you don't need to share. And speak to Yorland if you want a better weapon than whatever that is. I've heard we've got some traders coming in and are. See if you can find some, and I'll try to find some more interesting work by the t Of course you will. Take the free arrows. Gives me 829. You've seen how little I do archery, so... Yay. Granted, usually by now I have like a little 70 alchemy, so I mean, it evens out. You must be one of those wizards from the college you need to follow. Nope.
and we have our first legendary skill. things up a little. Anything over six and you gotta put it in together. people upgrading the potions. There are less of them, but they're powerful. Oops. Good to see. You. Lead the way. Let me know if you have anything you need from me. I am sworn to carry your burdens. Yes, you are. Take this. <laughs> I will be back at your house if you need me, Faye. There you go. The plate of fall wreath isn't going to get stored away forever, but. For now it is. That's stolen, so we're gonna just put that in there in case I get turned in by jerks. where we're going to call it for right now because things to do and people to see we did accomplish a few things we've joined the companions we've completed several quests for the companions as you can see so it was a shorter stream not really a little over two hours so an average stream Next up, we'll, looks like we'll be going north to collect bear pelts. <laughs> Interesting work, I'm sure, but we might be getting close to some more relics. We'll see. So until next time, I will see everyone later. Doodles.